Nicole. Hopefully you are doing well. Um, hopefully I'm trying to work on the setup with being able to see everything um, well. So hopefully you'll be able to as I show you. Um, so there's a couple things. One, we're releasing a new product, which uh, tomorrow on our website, www.bellartdanicole.com, which is tower covers. So I'll show you those for two of our towers. Um, the towers Jamie created and then the covers Jamie created. Um, then I want to show you the two new grinder colors that we have. This is a free file um, off of a site called Thingiverse, and then he heavily modified it to uh, be the best for um, helping with those stuck together drills. Then we've got our flower funnel um, in bubblegum pink. So I guess I could just show you that, and that could be that. Um, we had it in like the daffodil yellow, so then we figured we'd do another color. So bubblegum pink will be tomorrow. Um, and then we've got our 2.0 trays, which is kind of like 2.1 trays because we kind of upgrade them a little bit. And same thing with these guys, which is our 3.0, kind of upgraded them to 3.1. Um, just forewarning, Jamie's not here. So we have two dogs, two cats, two guinea pigs, never fails that one or all of them are going to say hi or make noise um, during the video. So uh, just forewarning about that. And then I will do my best to go through this pretty quickly. Um, but if you are tuning into this video, don't forget to hit the thumbs up, like, and subscribe. We are going to be celebrating 3,000 YouTube subscribers coming up. We're trying to figure out what we want to do with that, but we did reach 3,000 YouTube subscribers, and I just felt like I would come on here, show you the new upgrade design, show you what we'd be releasing on Tuesday, um, just in case you didn't have time to catch into our Saturday Live. Okay, so I'm going to get into it. So we have, um, not sure if this is showing quite right, but we have um, translucent red for the grinder. You put the drills in and then you kind of go side to side. Um, I do have a video on how the grinders work, so I'll include it in the description below. I'm not as tech savvy to do it in that little eye that's in the corner. Maybe if I can figure it out, but otherwise it'll be in the description. So we have translucent red and then translucent green. So that is going to be tuna colors that we have for that. Um, and these are, like I said, heavily modified by Jamie so that they will not scratch up your drills. Um, people have been in grinders a lot lately <laughs> all right then we have our 2.0 tray designs which um is actually like a 2.1 design so um last was it last friday last friday not this past friday but the friday before um a couple of people on a post that we made said that their lids fall off really easily and that was like Friday night. So then Saturday, we did our live. Jamie started thinking on it. He created a notch that was here. And then it would kind of, you know, slide onto there and lock on. Or not lock on, but stay there. Um, secure it a little more. But then that kind of got, got in the way. So then I was like, hey, well, we already have this bridge kind of thing. Can we just put it there? So together, we figured this out. <laughs> so if it has a little divot right here. And it has a little notch right here so when you slide the lid on don't forget to find that little groove um, I do have a uh, TikTok video if you go to TikTok on how to put these on uh, just slide the lid on and so it kind of as you can hear it kind of clicks a little bit so we have for tomorrow we're doing um, harvest gold and midnight black um, for the colors and you can see there that there's that little notch um, and these are in one small or you can get them in one large and the large also has that little notch and the little groove and it goes like that um, so just trying to make them a little bit more secure we're not going to say that they lock into place or anything like that because they will wear in over time probably more than likely but we are doing our best um we hear you and we always try to upgrade when um possible and so this is kind of like our 2.1 design so these are original tray designs they do stack so as you can see they stack so our design was um our original design which we have a patent pending on is that the trays stack the shape of the you know tray the sliding lid um we did the two we did the 3.0 design um patented that one it's a patent pending um hopefully coming in before too long um and so this is an original design by jamie with the stack it stackability so this is our 2.0 that we brought back 
back because a lot of people like the 2.0 design. And then we have, here's our little tiny cube and tiny tray, which this is based off of our Thingiverse tray, which is a free file. Um, like I said, off of Thingiverse, we give credit to the original designer. And we 3D print our magnets into the cover minders. So we have a little cube, it has a little heart and little butterfly on it, and then a little tiny tray that you can use as a cover minder, kind of trash drill container. So we've got that. Uh, this is a brand new color. It's silk magenta. Is really pretty. It's a little bit... Uh, I mean, maybe a little bit darker than what it's showing here, uh, but it's a really pretty color. And then we've got the uh, silk cyan, which is uh, cyan blue, which is what we did for the Dakota Thon tray, if you have that. And so now we're offering it in the tiny tray and cube, and then the trays. So these are kind of, like I said, 3.1 design. So the notches are right here on either side here. This is, uh, the shape again was, uh, designed by Jamie. The, uh, the, Wall heights is part of our patent. The sliding lid is part of the patent. The um, spacing, the height of the lines, also the inside funneling. There, basically, if you lose your um, stopper, you can still use the tr you can still use the tray because it has a little ramp here. Trust me, I lose stoppers all the time. Um, and then also the, um, but more importantly, is the shape. Um, and the stackability. So there's little divots there, little and then little notches here, so it kind of clicks into place and kind of maybe hear it where it clicks in a little bit. Um, and so we have that. We have one small and one large as the variation. You can see the little notches there. And then you can also get a tray set is another variation. So that's three variations there. Then we've got our Thingiverse tray, which Jamie heavily modified. And you can actually uh, 3D print this, but just not for commercial use. Um, and the lid just kind of like goes on top so it doesn't lock into place. Then we've got our three divider tray, if the camera wants to focus. There we go. And so again, it's got the two little notches here and then the tray leg kind of goes into there and it kind of, you know, secures it a little more. And our three divider tray is great and versatile because you can use it for three colors. You could take the divider out, use it for two colors or take both of them out and then use it as a single tray. So this is one of our most versatile trays. I actually just did a video yesterday on it that I'll link in the description down below if you want to see how those work. Um, and then the lid slides on. And then we've got our max tray. And again, it has the little notches and then it holds onto them like so. So we've got the, wow, <laughs> we've got the silk magenta. If it ever wants to focus, come on. There we go. So we got the silk magenta and then we've got the silk cyan. So here is the blue. It's pretty true to color. So again, you can purchase this as a set. They stack um, or you can purchase it as one large or you can purchase one small by itself. Same thing with the three divider. You could purchase a three divider in that color, the Thingiverse tray, and then we've got the Max tray. So that's with the new little kind of upgraded design there, so you can see that. And then the other thing that I have for you guys is our 16 tower for our large trays. We have a new tower cover for it. Again, it doesn't lock into place or anything, but it goes around the tower and will hold the trays in. And the stoppers can't really come out because Jamie made it where the honeycomb pattern is kind of going over the stoppers and kind of holding them in. So we've got it for our 16 large tray tower, and then we've got it for our 24 right? 8, 16, 24. Yeah, 24 small tower. There's one missing there and there's one missing there, <laughs> but it's for the 24 tower. And so again, it just goes around the side and then the honeycomb pattern is so that you can see all those pretty colors that you purchased. So it doesn't hide all of those. And then it holds the stoppers in there. So hopefully you have found this video helpful. Hopefully you like the new upgrades that Jamie and I did. We are always trying to um, improve things as quickly as we can. Um, and yeah, so, uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below and I'll do my best to get back to you. Um, and 
If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing and following along. You can hit the little bell button to be notified of future videos. So hopefully you have enjoyed this and until next time, see you then. Bye everyone.